All right, Samantha, if we want to find the vertex of a quadratic uh, equation like this, then, uh, you know, this is in what's called standard form, when we have that ax squared plus bx plus c kind of setup. So it's not as easy as it, as it is if, it, if the graph is in vertex form. Uh, so we have to do a little bit of work here, and we have to memorize a, a formula to do this. So we're going to start by finding our x value. Our x is going to be located at uh, the opposite of b over 2a. Okay, and so for this particular equation, our a is 1, our b is negative 2, and our c is negative 10, right? So for, plug it into this formula, I want the opposite of b, so if b is 2, then the opposite of b is, or if b is negative 2, the opposite of b is 2, over 2 times our a value is 1, so 2 over 2 is 1. That's going to be the x value. And remember, when we're making a vertex, we're trying to make an ordered pair. And so that's like the first half of my ordered pair. Okay, the second half of my ordered pair I'm going to get by taking that value and I'm going to plug it in to my function. So all my x's are going to get replaced with 1's. And then we're just going to work it out. So that's like 1 minus 2 minus 10. It's like negative 11. Okay, and that's going to be my y value that's going to go into my ordered pair there. And, and that's my vertex, 1 and negative 11. And for this particular problem, that's, that's all we need to answer the question. Okay, so hopefully that uh, clears things up a little bit. Uh, let me know if you have any other questions.